What's up guys, Jeff from AGL Tech, and I haven't did one of these videos in over five months. That's been a while. And I figured I've had some changes having to my desk setup, so why not make a second version of my ultimate desk setup? So I'll be showing you guys everything like for my PC all the way down to my peripherals and in my footrest I have down here. And then at the end, if you stick around to the end, I have a giveaway. So let's first start out with showing you this where it all starts. At this outlet. Okay, I'm just kidding. It doesn't start there. We're just going to start with the PC, actually. So this nice, beautiful PC, it has a Ryzen 1700 with a Gigabyte GAAB350 gaming motherboard, 16 gigabytes of DDR4 Corsair Vengeance Red LED RAM, Corsair Speco 2Ks, EVGA GTX 960, a 2GB card, it's a SSC edition, a SanDisk Ultra 2 480GB SSD, and last but not least, the power supply. It was a Corsair 6X600M. This PC, I did a video on it. It was a build guide. It was called Blaziken Build Guide or something like that. So you can see my phone right there. It's a Galaxy S7. Also, the review on that too. Then you can also see it saying on an anchor phone stand. Then also, you see my 1440p Dell monitor. Now, you can't really find it now these days. So, sorry, I won't have that link down below. But I'll have most of the stuff linked down below for you guys. Now, if you guys were here when I first started my channel, you noticed I had a G710 Plus before. Well, I downgraded to a 213. And you guys might be thinking, why did you do that, Jeff? Well, the answer is pretty simple. I didn't really use it, the extra keys that were on there. And I won RGB, so. And then I'm also going to put that G710 Plus in a giveaway for you guys. So stick around. Then also, I have the G502 mouse. It's really nice. I so I have that same chair that I did a review on, that executioner chair. Oh, it's still nice. It still works perfectly fine for me. I've had it for about a year, so hopefully it just keeps working until I buy a new one. So this caddy I have here, I put some techie stuff in it, so let's go through it. Let's start our way from the bottom and all the way up. So for in the bottom drawer, I have a case. I have some earbuds. I just have some boxes for my PC stuff, for my accessories and all of that. Then also have a microfiber cloth to clean off things. Then in the middle, I have a glass screen protector, my weights for my mouse. I have a stock Intel CPU core. I have my old phone box, which I ended up getting rid of that phone because my brother broke his, so I gave mine to him. And then my Wi-Fi extender box, I also have a review on that too. Like, I got a review on quite a bit of this stuff. I never noticed how much reviews I had. Now on the top drawer, you see that I have that box right there i put some cords and pc accessories in it then you also see that little pouch i put my sd cards in there and my mini sd cards in there also in the inside the bigger pouch pocket i put my little toolkit that i fix and stuff with any electronic items because they're really small screwdrivers and they really can't fit anywhere else now last but not least my foot rests it's very nice i We'll try to find it and put a link down below, but I'm not going to guarantee you that I'm going to find it, but it's a really nice foot rest. It does what it needs me to do and was better than I thought it'd be, to be honest. So, I'm getting rid of my G710 Plus. I figured I could sell it or I could give it away for free. So, first you have to hit that like button, get subscribed down below, then also, last comment your email down in the comments below. And then also, say what keyboard you have and why you want this keyboard. Now I'll only be asking for your guys' mailing information so there will be no credit cards or anything else. It's just going to be your name and address and everything you'll need to ship. That's pretty much it for you guys. Thank you for watching. So if you like this video, give it a huge thumbs up and get subscribed to below. Well, I guess I already told you to do that. But anyways, I'll catch you guys in the next one.